And now to City Heights, where police are looking for the person who shot and killed a man in the front yard of a home. The shooting was reported just after 11 o'clock this morning at 40th Street between Thorne and Redwood. ABC 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco is joining us now live from the neighborhood. And Rachel, police say the shooter is a young man. Hi, Kimberly. Some witnesses say the shooter looked to be as young as 15 years old. Police are still looking for him at this hour. He was last seen running from this neighborhood. The victim's body was found near where you see those two blue tents. At this point, a motive is still unknown. People who live nearby say the area is becoming more violent. Families with young children watched as police taped off their neighborhood. 40th near Thorne is still a massive crime scene. The calls to 911 started just after 11 Tuesday morning. Neighbors hearing multiple gunshots. I saw the pa 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 pa, and I looked uh, inside the, my. Uh, uh, I looked uh, over there, and I saw one boy go around. Police say a 35 year old man was in the front yard of a home in the 3200 block of 40th. He was suffering from at least one gunshot to the upper body. A bystander started CPR until paramedics got here, but the man died at the hospital. It's unclear if the shooting happened inside the house or in the yard or if the two knew each other. The shooter is only described as a youthful looking male, possibly a teenager. A woman died like from the skate park and I live like kind of right in between these two crime scenes. Uh, and I go walk by myself to school so recently, it's been kind of scary. Belen Lopez is referring to 66 year old Chi Cao. She was fatally stabbed more than a week ago while on her morning walk less than a half a mile away at Central Avenue Mini Park. Police believe her attacker chose her at random. He's in jail facing a mental competency exam. Back on 40th, neighbors are taking precautions. Every day I like to walk, every day, every day. And r right now, no more, no. no. Like happened the, the this, the yeah. lady, uh, no more. Forward, they have not released the name of the victim. Reporting live in City Heights, Rachel Bianco, ABC 10 News. Thank you, Rachel.